Hi, I'm Kimberly Durden. I'm a board certified lactation consultant and I've been helping moms and babies breastfeed for over 20 years. It's time to go back to work and you're wondering how am I going to do this and continue to breastfeed my baby? Well, it's all possible, don't worry. I'm going to talk to you about how to pump and store your milk in preparation for getting back to work. While you're still home with your baby, you'll want to start pumping and storing your milk about two weeks before you go back to work. If you pump once a day for about two weeks before you go back to work, you should be able to store a nice amount of milk in your freezer in preparation for that first day back. That milk that you store is going to be milk that your baby can use while you're away from your baby. While you're at work, you'll also pump your milk at work and that milk can be added to the milk that you have at home for your baby to use when you're not with them. One suggestion that I give to my moms who are going back to work is to start work on a Wednesday or Thursday of the week instead of a Monday. That will give you a shortened week and you'll have the weekend to readjust and look at your pumping schedule and your plan of how you're going to handle working and breastfeeding. While you're away from your baby, you'll have to pump your milk at work. There are lots of breast pumps available that make pumping and storing your milk at work very simple. You'll want to talk to your employer before you come back to work about a comfortable place where you can express your milk. You can express or pump your milk in your office or you can use a, a storage closet. You can even use your car. Some employers create a special room where moms can pump and store their milk. Once you pump your milk at work, you'll store it in a cooler bag or a refrigerator, and then you'll bring that milk home for your baby to use at a later time. Talk to your employer during your pregnancy to discuss your intentions for when you come back to work. You'll need break times to express your milk at work. During an eight hour day, many moms find that they need at least two breaks to express their milk for their baby. Some states even have laws that protect your right to pump your milk at work for your baby to use at a later time. How do you balance breastfeeding your baby at home and giving your baby pumped milk when you're away? Well, start by nursing right before you leave for work. That will cut down the number of bottles that you'll have to leave for your baby when you go to work. So before you leave for work, the last thing that you wanna do is just sit down and enjoy nursing your baby. In preparation for when you're coming home from work, you'll want to make sure that your baby doesn't get any bottles of your milk too close to the time that you'll be coming home. You'll want the caregiver to time your baby's feedings so that when you come home from work, you can just drop everything and again, just sit down and enjoy nursing your baby. Check out the website workandpump.com for excellent information on going back to work without having to wean your baby. I hope this gives you some tips for being unafraid of going back to work and continuing to breastfeed. You can do it, moms, I know you can. Thanks for watching.